What are you going to do? He's Australia's most famous bath mat. Agro was created in 1981 by Seven Brisbane. Hi there, this is Agro here at the Gold Coast. At first, Jamie Dunn was Agro's producer, not the voice. Hello. Come in there. Alright. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you have to do that then? Yeah, you got it. What am I talking to you like that for? <laughs> I yes, don't know. You Just do your stuff when you're doing it. But soon after, Jamie got his shot to become the voice of Agro. And so the other guy moved on and they needed someone uh, the next day, live television. So uh, they rang me up and said, can you do it? I said, yeah, absolutely. And I practiced the voice all night. I was really going to nail this because this is my chance, you know. And so uh, I came up here on Saturday morning, I lay down on the floor and I put the puppet up on the bench and I was just perfect. I was going, G'day kids, here you go on now. Welcome to the Super Saturday Show. Boy, have we got fun for you today. And the floor manager crawled across the floor and he held up a handwritten note that said, can you please make the puppet's mouth move when he speaks? Because I was going, G'day kids, how are you? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, anyway. And the rest is history. We get up every morning just as the sun is doing and put our show together for you. So make the connection, the content connection will make you laugh and help you get through. Let Anna and me keep your company. Australian television took a shine to him. He was a guest on all the big shows, even hosting Steve Vizard's Tonight Live. My next guest is less than three feet tall, has more hair on his face than I do. He draws a little bath mat to a megastar. Must be a hell of a surprise to you. And a lot of stitching too, I'll tell you, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. It was a surprise to me. I, I didn't expect it one bit, and nor did the porky guy under the desk here. What do you think of that? What do we think of that? No, don't repeat everything I say. Repeat what he says. Oh, well, are you a bunch of turkeys? We're a bunch of turkeys. Oh, Oh, when I get the aggro out of the bag, it doesn't matter whether kids have seen him on television or not, because he's been off TV for, I don't know, 10 years maybe. Uh, or it doesn't matter how old they are, there's just something about him.